All right, here, let's wrap it up. Okay, so 95 and um, I got 12, so 95 and 100. 100 bucks, I love it. Yeah. Thrifting ain't easy. I'm feeling creepy. Comping diapers on my eBay app. Good morning, how are you? I'm well. Got any questions? Some of the tags are falling off. If you find something that okay. falling off, give me a holler. All right, sounds good. That's the, do you do? Do you collect? Um, I do like a little buying and selling okay. mostly. Okay, that's occupied. Some lady come and bought because I just don't know yeah. a bunch more. That's occupied Japan. Hang on, there's some more. And I just marked this down. That's Occupied Japan. Okay. They usually bring really well. Yeah. You know, it really, really, really well. And I just marked those down. Uh, that's all I... Oh, this is Occupied oh, yeah. Japan. Yeah. Yeah, this is Occupied Japan. And, I, you know, I'd leave it like that. I wouldn't try and clean it right. or nothing. Um, oh, I marked it to three. three. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And that, I believe, is Occupied Japan, right? No, that's no, Japan. Yeah. But it doesn't yeah. say made in, so it's right. still pre-1960. Right, there you go. <laughs> I do like those. That's pretty cool. That's it. The recipe box is not. I thought one of the... Oh, this one was. Didn't I just... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Occupied. yeah. Okay. I'm I was going to say, I thought one of the canisters were. <laughs> Are you a collector? Um, no, I had a, here, I'll put that stuff up here oh, for sure. you. I had a shop for about 25 years and uh -huh. I closed it seven, eight years ago. Gotcha. So this is literally about all, I've got some old comic books and stuff in here. So it's about all I got left. Oh, that's cool. Are the comic books for sale in here? Yeah. I got a, yeah, what I got left is right here. Oh my okay. God. Yeah. 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 There you go. GameStop or whatever. Yeah. Baby toys. Baby toys. Oh my god, I used to go in there with my dad. Yep. Oh my god, that is so cool. What else do you look for? Anything? I really like vintage stuff, so I mean. Just vintage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, the stadium. Oh, the stadium special. Oh. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Oh, wow, I want that one number two. That was really awesome. That's what Score. That was the last time. That was the last time. Hi, baby girl. The 64s when we were trying to play Gordon and I, and we tried everything we could on our last and we tried everything, messing with the parameters of the screen and everything, and it was just so terrible. And I'm like, yeah, let's just, we don't have the here, you know, sweet right. potatoes. I just said that. Take me yeah, to the box. Yeah, no, what? Here we go. I'm like, you know what? We just, I'm sorry to hear We don't have a box TV anymore, so it doesn't look the same. Hey, I've got a game that is what? I got one of those LCDs. Um, oh, those are, but yeah, well, be careful. That one stuck a lady yesterday. Okay. Just buy the, I mean, I just threw stuff in yeah. a bag. Yeah, As yeah. you can see. Yeah, do you know um, what the bracelet's made of? The, uh, huh? Do what, you know what the bracelet's made of? That looks like bake light to me, but that's too, well, no, that's oh, not yeah, yeah. too new to be bake light. You know what? Uh, yeah. Oh, there you are. Okay, it's um, now the portrait hmm. on your top. Good job. No, I don't. Uh, <laughs> well, that's hold on. Right, I put the director oh. there too much. Well, I'm doing the whole bag. Uh, there's some coins. Uh, you can have the whole bag for 
four dollars. Okay. And uh, I don't know what the, even the coins are. Look at how little that thing yeah. is. <laughs> Look at how little that thing is. I'll get that one too. Um, that one you have for four dollars also. Deal. Okay. So that's I got to write these down or I'll forget. Okay, so you got five, nine, ten. You're at thirteen dollars okay. right now. Sounds good. Okay. Yeah, you know, my just... wife is going to come look around, but our baby girl is going to come away here. Oh, was oh, she in the car? Yes, yeah, just to the baby. Oh. Oh, we'll go out and relieve her and let her come up. How old is the baby? She's uh, eight months. Oh, she's a little baby. Oh, yeah. goodness. Yeah, my baby is uh, three and a half now, and a little boy's hair, so. <laughs> That's what you have to look forward to. Yeah. <laughs> Where's she going, Angela? She's on the porch. Oh, the chalk. I don't want to let her out there by herself, still. <laughs> oh, no, she's not trying to chalk. She's fishing in the bird bath. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I work in the police department too, so. <laughs> I'm a union uh, carpenter. Okay, yeah. I work in the union. Yeah, so you probably understand. <laughs> you just have that whole tray of earrings for a buck. Okay. We make it hard to say no, don't you? Yeah. Well, like I said, this is what I have left, so. So that'll be worse. Would you make a deal on all these or uh or that's what oh, that God. lady wanted that's to do too um let me i can see pick and choose many, if not let me see how many i have okay here, okay yeah she, it's a big deal i can pick and choose if you don't okay. want to um, mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean that sixty dollars oh, worth of pens, yeah. basically. Yeah. So this folk art one I like. I do that. Yeah, that, that's a definitely one I want. That one I think is Boy Scouts. <laughs> so um, if you get all of them, I'll go half. I'll do thirty for the whole thing, and you can even have the velvet pillow I made too. Thirty. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. So you are at forty-four dollars. Forty-four dollars. Yes, okay. Sir. Let me take one final look here. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness, that kid scared me. Look at it. That's crazy right there. You scared your Mimi. That's some crazy stuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What do you have on your sterling flower? Oh, um, we have it. Oh, nice. Um, you're at 44. 44, yeah. Oh my gosh, it's a dinosaur. Because you're doing this, I'll do six more, and that'll be an even 50. Perfect. I like it. <laughs> okay. Put that in your pocket, though. Okay. Honey. I don't want to lose. I don't want to Because <laughs> that good. enamel, I would probably, if, uh, if you have a flea market, mm -hmm. I would probably put 35, 40. Yeah, that's a nice little that. piece. That's yeah, the sterling cool. enamel is a little rare. Yeah, I like it. So, so yeah, you know. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. I haven't got ready to get rid of that yet, but I wouldn't. <laughs> Brian, no kidding. Right, look at this table one more time. Okay. Where are you going? <laughs> The gold one is so beautiful. <laughs> yeah, my, my link to the cast is my pride and joy with Zelda. I don't have the box for it, but I love that game. Yeah, I think mine is SNES. Oh, God. Okay, you made the steps. Cool. Oh, you got a box. You ain't gonna get that. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, it's hard work. <laughs> well, thanks for making the drive. Yeah. Have a good yeah, one. Take care. Have a safe trip home. Yeah, thank you. Look at her little hand. Oh, it is. Oh, it's Laura. She startled us. Oh, look, it's Do you have any cookies or anything in the house? Well, uh, it's not a ground If they're sugary, it don't come off that too. It's a coconut purse. Yeah. I've had a hundred people pick it up and that's probably not an exaggeration. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Here. Alright. Are you walking too? Or no, I'm no, I'm parked okay. behind those trees. I was gonna say you're gonna Oh no. Okay. So that's 70? Yes, sir. Well, it was part of the yeah. Coke thing. They, oh, yeah, they I are. I think they might have just fallen yep. out. Okay. I pushed those little Coke things oh, okay. in there. Got a couple oh, more what? for you. Okay. Mm, you were at 70? Mm -hmm. We'll just do 75. Sure. Awesome. Okay. Sorry. Sorry, I had to get a sugar oh, no. You're fine. <laughs> I get it. Got some neat stuff here. Thank you. This is it. Like I said, I'm got a lot of jewelry left at home, but that's it. Um, are you, I have a lock case but yeah. I just forgot it yeah. or I would have had a lot more out okay so 75 now I'm old I'll forget if I don't write it down <laughs> <laughs> now do you set up someplace or I do have a booth down at uh, J, uh, JW Riley's oh okay but then I do like a lot of selling online mm -hmm. and stuff too mm -hmm. oh, that's these snake skin too yeah Oh, do you like it? Yeah, I do like okay. it. Uh, no, I had a I lady look, and that. So I paid like thirty dollars for that. So I almost a, so seventy-five and eight on the snake skin. Um, six. We'll do five, and then we'll do uh, seventy-five, eighty-eight. I'll just do two on that then. So okay. make it an even ninety. 90? there. Sterling and turquoise? Yeah, those things, sterling, that's sterling, okay. yeah. Because I'll mark them, because I use a loop, yeah. you know, to look at them with. And then, like, for some reason, it's got the copyrights of six and a nine. I don't know what yeah. that is, but, you know, I wrote it on the tag. Right. <laughs> what? That's weird. They're bisque, porcelain. They're just neat. Yeah, that's pretty neat. <laughs> All right, here, let's wrap it up. Okay, so 95 and um, I got 12, so 95 and 100. 100 bucks, I love it. Yeah, I'll, I'll here, go ahead and hold them too. Sure. I don't want to lose them in a okay. sack, okay? That's fine, thank you. This, I don't know, I probably, I, I don't, I'm not telling you, I mean, because my dad was not here for 38 years. People I, love I'd those little I put 25 bucks on yeah. that. Okay. People love those little pocket Oh, trucks. yeah, yeah. I don't remember I said a hundred even, right? Yep. Okay. <laughs> That's good. Look, I looked down there. I just told you I'm old. I forget. <laughs> Best hundred I've spent today. Awesome. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Thank good. you very Good. Thank much. you so much. Thank good you for working with, with me. Yourself, all right. Okay? All right. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Appreciate it. Well, that's a sale you could have blinked and missed it. And that was awesome. All right. Let's get this stuff back and take a look at it. All right, guys, we are back in the garage. Pretty awesome little garage sale. I'll be honest, I almost didn't stop, 
but I'm really glad I did. Definitely didn't look like much from the road, but the lady was super nice and she had some really cool stuff tucked back there. And it seemed like the more of the, of the smaller stuff I bought, the better deal she was just automatically giving me on the good stuff. So that was, that was pretty cool. It's not necessarily a haul that I'll make a huge fortune on or anything, but it's just some really neat stuff and I do honestly think there's plenty of room left on it. So real quick, let's take a look at some of this stuff. All right, so I'm 100 bucks all in. Let's take a look at some of these grab bags first. A lot of this stuff is really no big deal. I picked up this one because I saw the horses in it. Uh, just kind of hoping they were something special. I don't, I don't really think they are, but toy horses can sometimes do pretty well. So I saw those in there and I grabbed the bag. The other stuff in this bag, there's an old bow tie. Uh, it's an old U clasp. I think that dates probably to like the 50s or 60s. A Beanie Baby piece there. A bunch of wadded up costume jewelry. Um, which kind of thing that I'll just probably throw in a crafter's lot or something. Just like really some junk in that one. This one I grabbed because the bracelet looked interesting. Um, thought perhaps it was Bakelite, but on closer inspection, I really don't think it is. But there is this little bag of uh, foreign currency in here. So those are always fun to go through. Pretty, pretty heavy little bag of change. So not really sure what's in there, but I'll look through that later. Uh, other stuff is a little bottle of, of unbraided perfume, a little pin cushion. A few more pieces of cheap costume jewelry. Again, no big deal, but I like gambling on little stuff like this because you never know. This grab bag actually had some pretty cool stuff in it. My favorite thing is this old Ronson Crown table lighter. I think these things are pretty cool. Uh, they usually sell for between like 10 and 35 bucks, depending on if you want to try to get it working or not. And that's actually what caught my eye for this grab bag. So pretty cool. Also in that bag is this old brass unicorn music box. It doesn't work and it's kind of broken, but I still think the uh, brass unicorn is pretty cool. So I'm sure that, that someone could repurpose that for some reason. Some old Rexall bandages. It's like an old wooden matchbox cover. I thought this old key tanner was kind of neat. It's a Buxton. It's missing one of the loops, but still still pretty cool genuine cowhide and then there's like a couple little buttons in there so yeah i definitely like this grab bag a lot more especially because of the lighter grab this tray of earrings because uh, i said i could have it for a dollar and i kind of thought the watch face earrings were pretty cool so i don't know those will those will lot up nicely with some other earrings i have an old coconut style kitty purse paint still looks good on that i've seen this before but i've never bought one so i went, I went ahead and grabbed it this time this little grab bag had a uh, parker pen and pencil set these are lions club variations and they're made in the usa they both work so those are those are definitely a good little pickup always look out for parker pins and cross pins and stuff like that that bag also had this little watch in it no big deal on that i believe this is an old creamer pitcher everyone knows i'm not a huge fan of glassware one one thing i do like is uh things that look like people i don't know why but i've been grabbing those a lot lately this is probably at least 60 years old and it's in really good condition so that was pretty cool i thought an old occupied japan ashtray it's got the card symbols like the hearts and spades and diamonds thought that was kind of neat got a couple books there's the greg shorthand dictionary simplified and there's an old girl scout handbook that'll lot up nicely and some scouting lot that i'll that i'll do here pretty soon a vintage viewmaster made by sawyers i believe these are made of bakelite and i think they're pretty cool very cool 1970s mini tow truck made by tonka pretty good shape overall always like picking these up when I see them. I, I think she charged me a dollar for that, so that's pretty awesome. I got this little miniature case of uh, Coke bottles. I could tell it wasn't complete when I got it, but I've done pretty well in the past kind of lotting up these, these bottles in lots of like four or five and selling them to people that need them for bottles they've lost. So uh, always grab those when they're not very expensive. There's a piece of Python pelt. Not really big enough to get huge money out of, but I've never really seen something like this, so of course I had to buy it. I just thought it was, I just thought it was weird and interesting. So I don't know, what is it? Two feet, a foot and a half, something like that, maybe. Cool vintage leather wallet. Um, some condition issues, but I think it has a really neat look to it. There's a couple old cigar felts. There's a 48 star flag and uh, a Zion flag right there. There's only two of them. These, these to really get like any sort of money out of them, you need quite a few more than I have here. But I mean, these will lot up in vintage drug drawer lots pretty easily too. So. I just thought they had a really cool look to them, and they were in pretty good shape. I bought all of her uh, brooches and pins. She wanted three bucks a piece. There's 21 total, so that was like, so that would have been what, 63 bucks. And I didn't really think that she was going to uh, come down half on them, but she did. And so by that point, it was it was kind of hard to say no. There are quite a few that I probably wouldn't have bought. So 
who knows if it was a great idea to actually buy them all like that. I do think buying all of these helped get me a better deal on other stuff. So it's all going to work out okay. There are some pretty cool ones on here. Some signed stuff, some interesting stuff. Um, homemade stuff, which is probably my favorite. Nice little Boy Scout medal, uh, probably from the 60s. There's a nice little Monet, little Jelly Belly bird I really like there. I like the butterfly quite a bit. The giant apple, it's pretty neat. I like the flower. Um, of course, I probably wouldn't have bought this one. This one's a little homemade owl. I do like that one quite a bit. I like this rose with the little fake stones in it. So yeah, there's enough here that I'm glad that I bought them all. And actually, I may end up using this pillow to uh, take some photos. I like the little homemade snowman. A little kilt pin with the dolphins. Probably wouldn't have bought that. But overall, I'm pretty happy with it. Especially when it comes to this one. This is my absolute favorite one. Uh, this like homemade cowboy. Looks like they use some dresser hardware as the backing. Um, and I, I just think it's pretty cool. Possibly a stone has fallen out right there. But I just love the tin cowboy. That's really cool. And I'm kind of thinking that that might get most of the $30 back. That's just a really neat homemade folk art piece. Definitely would have bought that one anyway. I think that's the big money maker on this entire pillow. Thought these bisque earrings were, were just super creepy and kind of cool. Look like little baby dolls or something. Those are weird. I can't I can't find really anything similar online to compare them with, but they were they were just pretty neat in my opinion. This is a pretty neat piece. It's a sterling and turquoise like chunky toggle bracelet. When she was talking about the hallmark, she thought it was a six and a nine. But actually, what it is, if you turn it sideways, it's a dollar sign. And that's the hallmark for Shub Dakota West. Nice little designer bracelet made of sterling and turquoise. So, so that should do pretty decent, I think. And probably my absolute favorite piece of the day is this old sterling and enamel flower brooch. Has a really nice old look to it. Just a nice little piece of silver. Not really sure what I'll end up getting for it, but I think it should do pretty well. Just a really neat little brooch in my opinion. All right, so that's everything. Quite a bit of stuff, but like I said, I think we'll do just fine. And that was just a really fun little garage sale in my opinion. And a lot of times the fun is what makes it all worthwhile. All right, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching the video. But until next time, stay safe, stay healthy. Love ya, bye. When they hear that cha-ching, and they all look at me I guess they'll know I'm buying this crap